Okay guys, so I'm doing another so solo system test here. Cause Jack's editing downstairs again. He keeps hiding from me. Why? So currently all the pull stations are the same except for one. And I'll go ahead and show you what that is. It is the um, Simplex 2099-9756. Push and pull down T bar. So Dual action. I was. Uh, why was it pushing for that? I don't know. But and for the alarm up here is a simplex ruler. I'm not sure what the model numbers on them are. I'm kind of new to simplex stuff. I haven't really collected much of them at all. I have. I only have like one simplex simplex device, and that's a strobe. Other than the pulse station and the and the simplex panel, that's it. And we got another true alert over here. Now there's nothing there, the spectral alerts are down, except for that one. So, we're going to do, make sure I have the keys in the panel. I will activate the smoke detector again. So, and this is really loud, too. Three, two, are pretty damn loud. This is ceiling man, I forgot to mention. The model was silenced, so I wasn't able to do that. Now, where is that tool at? Oops. Wait. Battery. Stupid battery. Now, here again. I had to turn the light off. there from that side. Still kind of loud out here too. There's a little fade out there. Now, I'm going to go ahead and clear the i3.
Yep. And then reset the pull stations too. Now, let's go ahead and get our simplex key out. Or should I say a Hudson key? Yep, simplex. Doing that again. I like doing that. Okay. Now it's time to reset. Do that problem, there we go. Do a drill. Why not? There we go. True alerts this time. See you guys in the next video.